Hi, folks. This is Don Meisner with the North Country Fishing Report. And I, I know I don't want to keep going on about the sports shows, but the sports shows reveal things to me so that I can do better at my job of trying to encourage people to come to this area. And one of the things that I've noticed through the years, and I, I think this is really important to pass on to all of you, fishing is different for all of us. There's so many different aspects of fishing that that we can zone in on. We can zone in on a certain type, and that becomes our favorite. It may change over time. It may not. But what people like to do now that they couldn't do years ago is because of cell phones. Now we have cell phones, and our cell phones can be terrific cameras. So now we can record the experiences that we have in the outdoors, and we can pass that on to others. We love to brag and show them about the wonderful fish we catch. But I want you to remember one thing. For some of us, a wonderful fish is completely different than for others. And so I have people come up to me and, and want to show me the fish that they caught last summer when they were on their vacation or they caught last week when they went down to the favorite streams. And the one thing I always do when I see these pictures is I rave. I rave about it to them. I don't say, well, you know what? I've caught a bigger fish than that. That would be the worst thing in the world to do, but I think a lot of people do that. Remember that their trophy, their trophy could be a 12-inch bass, but to them, that was a wonderful fish. They're excited about it. And the worst thing we can do is scowl and say, well, you know, that's tiny. That's nothing compared to what I've done. Now, I may be over-exaggerating this, but I don't think so. I remember one time watching an episode of The Office on TV, and and the the two people went to they they collaborated to make a sale and they go to the to, to the office of this potential customer that they want and he has a picture of a great fish up on the wall that he's smiling with he's holding the rod and Andy the the guy that went along with Michael the t- the two people from the show says he says oh that's nothing compared to the one that I shot I got this one I got it with a gun or something but, but the moral of this story was they didn't get the sale because the one thing they should have done is praise the, the guy for the wonderful fish. And that would have made him feel more connected with them. And it's no different with the, with the pictures we see on Facebook, the people that we meet along the way. I go in a store and somebody shows me a picture of a fish. I'm always going to compliment them. I'm never going to comment on other fish that could have been bigger or taken. I think it's important to realize that. And that lesson goes to other things in life. I think the, the, the important thing that we can all do is always try to, to let somebody, if somebody's excited enough to want to share something with us, then just take the time to listen. Until next time, folks, this is Don Meisner with the North Country Fishing Report.